A Minnesota judge has taken the unusual step of allowing four protesters to use a necessity defense, enabling them to present evidence that the threat of climate change from Canadian tar sand crude justified their attempt to shut down two Enbridge Energy pipelines last year. The ruling was made by Judge Robert Tiffany of the 9th Judicial District in Clearwater County. Emily Johnson and Annette Klapstein acknowledge they turned the shutoff valves on two pipelines in Clearbrook as part of a coordinated action against five pipelines in northern states. A total of 11 activists were charged. Johnston and Klapstein of the Seattle area say that as far as their team knows, this is the first time a judge has allowed a full necessity defense on a climate change issue. They're due to go on trial December 11th. Two co-defendants who filmed them will stand trial later. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.